Hi, my name is Kelly Nicholson, and I'm here to talk to you about the IntelliDose. Now that we've said that we have five part, a uh, five part nutrient blend, we're going to go back to our menu and go into the dosing settings. We've already set our basic TDS settings and our pH, but now we have to talk about our mix output. When you are dosing multiple nutrients, your nutrients and your additives don't always dose at the exact same rate. Some will dose at five mils per gallon, some will dose at 10 mils per gallon. So the mix output can become pretty important. You have a couple of options. You can either alter the dilution rate of the nutrients and keep everything at 100%, so everything doses across the board evenly, or you can keep all of the dilution rates the same and actually change the amount of time that the pumps come on. So for example, if I had my A and my Bs were my most used, those would be my 100%. But maybe my part three could be an additive that I'm supposed to use 50% as much as I do as my nutrients. So I can change this to 50% for part three. Too fast. And then my part four, maybe I only use a quarter as much of that. So on this one, I'm gonna change it to 25%. And then on my part five, maybe I actually use the equal parts to my nutrients, so I'll leave it at 100%. What that means is that if these pumps turn on for three seconds for my nutrient parts A and B, when I get to my part three, my nutrient part three, it's going to turn on for one and a half seconds. That's 50% as much time as the three seconds. When it gets to part four, it's going to turn on for 0.75 seconds. So they are all based on what my dose time is and then the percentage of time that that will turn on. And so that's how we can make sure that our additives are added in the proper ratio to our nutrients. And that's how we set up our TDS dosing. From us at American Hydroponics, happy growing.